Hi everybody, my name is Allison Schley and I'm here to wish you a happy Bosses Day. I just really am tired of all the negativity on Facebook and social media and I really think it's important that we look at all the blessings that we have. There are so many and I really thought today would be the perfect day. I'm a deaf and hard of hearing teacher in the daytime and I love my job. I've had great um, bosses over the years. I've learned a lot of how to be a better me. I've also learned how not to do some things from some of the bosses. But what I really think is cool is that I realized, wow, I'm a double boss of my own. Today I'm celebrating me, to be quite honest. And I think that's okay. I don't think we're allowed to celebrate enough. Us, e us enough. So I have two different companies that I own. One is called Forever Friends. And I taught deaf and hard of hearing kids for 20 years. So I wrote some children's books about deaf children and a deaf dog. And then my other business that I own is Unique. Um, I'm an independent consultant for them. I don't own the whole company. That would be pretty cool. But I am my own boss. And what I think is so amazing is that whether I'm selling my books or selling makeup, it's on my terms. There's so much freedom. I'm a mom of two children. I have a day job. I have a husband, a house to run. And I also am caring for my mom with Alzheimer's. But still, I can make money and spread joy through my two companies. And that is what I love. When you're your own boss, you can do whatever you want. I can be on the internet and I can sell my makeup. I uh, sit on my Facebook all day anyway, so why not sell some makeup while I'm doing it? We have Facebook parties and I'm in charge of when I set them up. It's so fun. As for my books, I go to some vendor shows or I sell that on the internet too. And I really, my purpose of course is to make some money, that's great. But at the end of the day, I'm more happy if I teach somebody something. I've been to a couple different events with my books, to be quite honest, and not one person bought a book. But what I left there feeling so happy about was the reaction of the children when I read them my stories. I taught their parents things about hearing loss that they didn't know. The kids were like, oh yeah, I do know someone in my class with a hearing aid. I'm going to be nice to them now. It was just so humbling to me that I could make that difference. And this is not about me bragging that I'm all that. It's actually quite the opposite. I was humbled that I was given this gift to share with people and the opportunity to do it on my own terms. That's what I love about being my own boss. As far as makeup, I've learned so much about makeup and beauty. I didn't really take care of my face that much before I started with Unique. I put on my makeup, I took it off. I now have creams and foundations and eyelash makeup and mascara and so much stuff that I never even knew was out there and I love every minute of it. I have people telling me I'm beautiful every day. That didn't happen before. It is such an empowering feeling and I want to spread that feeling to other people. That's why I love what I do. I just, I love going out there. I love spreading joy. I love seeing people's faces when they get new products or when they get my books. It just makes me happy. And that's what I really think we need to focus on. There's so much negativity, like I said. There is a lot of good out there. We just need to look for it. One of the things that I've always believed in is helping somebody else and it helps you feel better. A few years ago, I founded a nonprofit for children with hearing loss and it didn't go as long as I wanted. It only lasted two years, but there was so much I learned during that time and I know that I touched lives of many during that process too. But one of the coolest things, that was the first time I was a quote unquote business owner and I learned how to take advice from others and pass it on. I had a friend, Leslie, who started her own business at the time and we just reached out to each other and that's how we met. We were giving each other tips on how to be better business owners and it made us both feel so much better and our businesses were flourishing. The people that sit there and they're their own boss and they're all that and they're high on their horse, they don't get very far. They might at the beginning, but they crash and they crash fast. It's people who build each other up and work together that are going to get far in the world. Whether you're a stay-at-home mom doing daycare and you work with other daycare moms for tips, whether you're a teacher in a school, whether you're your own business owner, it doesn't matter what you do. Really, we have to work together. That's how the world will be a better place. And I'm so thrilled and humbled to be a part of it. I'm feeling fabulous right now. And I'm just so thankful for the gifts I've given, the powers that have been able to teach me how to do things. God has blessed me with so much, and I feel like it's my job to give back. So I try to do a lot of fundraisers with my books and my makeup. I want to spread the wealth, and I want to really spread the love. So 
I hope that you take some tips away from me today on how to be a better you, how to be a better leader. And remember, don't ever give up on your dreams. I've wanted to write children's books since I was a tiny child. I have stacks and stacks of kids' stories packed away. I still have them. My kids don't know where they are. The thing is, I never thought I could do it. And one day I thought, heck, I'm going to try. And look at me now. I'm on my third book. Someone hired me to write a third book. Mm -hmm. That was a pretty humbling moment. They paid me money. It was pretty cool. And I love what I do. And I love the leaders in the unique company. They have taught me so much. They're above me. They're beside me. And some people who are below me. They teach me every day. And they do it because they care. It's just a wonderful place I'm in right now, and I'm so blessed, and I'm thankful, and I hope it continues for a long time, and I think that it will if I continue to spread the love. So please reach out to me. I would love to help you, whether you're in Unique as a new presenter, whether you want to join my team, whether you want to learn how to write a book, whether you just want to learn for your own company how to be a better you. I would love to help you. So you can email me at allison at the number two foreverfriends.com. You can comment here. You can find me on Facebook at twoforeverfriends.com or unique, Y-O-U-N-I-Q-U-E by Allison L. Schley. We'll get together. Have a wonderful day and happy Bosses Day to all you bosses out there.